The Change 5 mission in 2020 marked China's fifth ever venture to the moon but, more importantly, it was the country's first sample return mission. The Chinese spacecraft landed on the moon on December 1, targeting a region previously unexplored by U.S. astronauts or Soviet probes. This was the first sample return mission since the Soviet Union's Luna 24 in 1976 and made China only the third country to collect samples from the moon when Change 5 landed back on Earth on December 16. Hailed a great victory for the Chinese space program, the mission has provided fascinating new insight into the moon's history. The rock and dust collected in the moon's Oceanus Procellarum region, Ocean of Storms, appear to be much younger than previously collected samples. The site was specifically chosen for Chang'e 5S landing because its creates suggested it was younger than the areas surveyed by the Apollo and Lunar missions. In total, the Change 5 spacecraft returned to Earth about 3.81 pounds, 1.73 kilograms, of lunar rock and dust. Subsequent analysis of the lunar material has confirmed that volcanism on the moon occurred much later than previously thought, and that has proven to be something of a scientific conundrum. According to a report in Space.com, scientists first dated a fragment of the lunar rock samples to about 1.97 billion years ago. This was done in October last year by researchers at the Washington University in St. Louis. At the time, Professor Brad Jolliffe, director of the university's McDonnell Center for the Space Sciences, called it a perfect sample to close a two-billion-year gap. Up until that point, all rock samples collected by the Apollo missions between 1969 and 1972, were found to be older than three billion years old. Professor Jolliffe said, and all of the young impact craters whose ages have been determined from the analysis of samples are younger than one billion year. So the Chang E5 samples fill a critical gap. A new study published in the journal Nature has now used a similar dating method on a different lunar sample and has found the lunar rocks to be about 2.03 billion years old. 